And we are back. Welcome to episode 13 of Istanbul 2020. Made a lot of changes. Uh, the astute uh, observer might notice that the game just kind of looks different. I ran into a YouTube video about uh, uh, just kind of changing the look of your game with various... Uh, add-ons that just kind of enhance the colors and the contrasts and the things like that. Um, which I think kind of gives it an interesting, although I may want to dial it down a little bit. What is the... Yeah, this thing. What is the... Uh, intensity, radius. Yeah, let's turn the radius on this down just a little bit. Maybe even turn the intensity down. Very good. Yeah. But, uh, just kind of give gives it a different look. Uh, and they're I may be tweaking it. There's all kinds of different looks you can give it. But I think that uh, looks very nice. But, uh, anyways, let's see. Uh, one thing I noticed, uh, city vitals, sewage treatment is getting low, and also electric electricity. Really? Garbage processing? I've got garbage processing everywhere. Okay, let's start uh, with electricity. Let's add a... Another nuke plant, why not? We have unlimited money, and they never melt down. At least, uh... Wow, this... Wait a minute, there was like nothing on here last time. Let us... Tell you what let's do. Let's start by... Just adding a little road up to here. Grab our nuke plant, and we'll just put a nuke plant right there. Gives our electricity. Yeah, what the heck. Let's put another one. Slope too steep. Of course, slope is too steep. Why would the slope not be too steep? Of course, slope too steep. <sighs> okay, I don't really want these roads here anywhere, anyways. Okay, now we have tons of electricity. Uh, what else did I... Uh, sewage treatment. Well, no, sewage treatment is... These guys, water treatment. And we got all our sewer thingies down. This, we sure have a lot of these. I mean, this... For a city of only 225,000 people, we need this many. I'm just going to add a bunch of them. It's not like we actually have to pay for them or anything. And then we just put one little uh, pipe coming on the land. I have the add-on that automatically 
distributes water. Uh, one of the things I really did not like about the vanilla game as it was originally created was you had to run water lines everywhere. Everywhere you had houses and roads and any kind of civilization, you had to run water pipes and it was crazy. Also electricity. You had to run electric lines everywhere. Garbage processing status. Now, let's see. Uh, if this actually increases... Yeah, it it actually works. It's let us We'll just add a bunch of them. I mean, you know, why not? Okay, that's good. Uh, very good. Now, let's see. Bef when I when we left last, I had added an extra railroad track here and of course it looks like it is backed up. Of course. Let's see. Let us look at our traffic. 72% pretty good. Uh, now this is a tunnel going into there now okay am I allow it looks like I am allowing trucks I also got a cool little uh, add-on that kind of changes there's way your roads look. I like that. It's kind of an um, specifically American looking roads. You can get American, European looking roads, whatever uh, you want. Um, Now, what shall, what shall I do? Let's see, this is, is this all ore? Yes, this is all ore. Uh, I think I'm going to add more industry. I mean, you know, why not? It's, it seems to, uh, work pretty good at uh, filling up should uh, increase jobs and things like that
That looks pretty good. Oh, I keep forgetting it defaults to the uh, little uh, pour, what do you call that, fill option. Okay, let's give that, let's see, we have no health care out here. We will need a medical clinic of some sort. I'd say that's close enough. Uh, fire stations. Uh, let's put the fire station down there. I think I really want fire, good fire protection in my industry. Advanced police headquarters. I don't know what that means, but it's got to be better. And I can put it all the way out here. Do not need any education. We do need parks. And of course, that means the builder's yard. Oh, there. Oh, okay. I see. We, we have a few builder's yards already. Let us put enough to cover everything. There we go. And it looks like so far they're just using it as a U-turn place. I don't know why vehicles make these bizarre routes. So we have a little more of that. And Okay, it's going to be hard to make this industrial without polluting all of this. Um, I think what I am going to do is take a road, say this size road, and I'm going to Just kind of make a make a little curve here. This is going to kind of separate this from that, and that will eventually be all industrial. What I really should do. Let us get rid of all of this. And this. Didn't I get rid of these roads? Tell you what, let's make this a little closer. Okay, we are going to have to bulldoze this and that. I thought I bulldozed all this. 
I guess not. And I don't know why I brought that way over there. Okay, I'm going to have to move some stuff. Elementary school. Put that there. Anything else? No, nope, I think everything else should... Uh, should self-demolish. Tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to... Bring that up and just kind of go like that. There we go. Now that somewhat separates that from that. Wow. I sure didn't... Uh, didn't do that very well. Um... We'll just demolish this. Demolish one more length of that. And we just want to come around here. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm just going to grab the move tool. And about that much of it, huh? Just kind of bring all this out here. How does that look? Still needs to come out some more. Maybe bring that out about that far. And just kind of gradually. There we go. I think that would be good. Yeah. And this can all end up being industrial eventually parking lot let us move it over there there we go another school high school we shall move it right there there we go so all this can be residential and other commercial Very good, very good. Population is up to 235,000 people. Let us, let's see. I think I should connect these two. Okay, that is all residential with some commercial and stuff over there. This is residential. I think I may put some more commercial up against the highway. 
let trucks take stuff there but keep the trucks out of here yeah that uh, that sounds like a plan now this six lane with bicycles I think that's what we want here and we probably want to change this does this have what kind of road is this four lane with bicycle now I think what we want to do is make this like a major thoroughfare so we're going to take six lane with bicycle upgrade this all the way to here now this is six lane but without bicycle yeah we want uh, we want as much bicycle path pathage as we can get so So we connect these. And we'll just take this. Now we have these connected. Now I made this yeah see I made this heavy traffic ban I want to undo that actually I think I'm going to just get rid of this I'm just going to erase this district altogether So now we can get trucks into here, but we don't want trucks they can go down to the commercial area. We don't want them coming on this road or this road so we just right there we do not want trucks policies heavy traffic ban there we go I really uh, what is that is that my first person camera configuration oh Okay, I guess there are options to the first person camera. Okay, this should allow our trucks to bring goods into this commercial district. Uh, they should also be able to come up through here. And even though they're not banned here, I can't imagine why they would want to
go down. Well, they could go down there, but I can't imagine why they would want to come up these roads here. Although they might want to go down that way. But I guess that's that's acceptable. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Now let us there's one thing, it's not something I'm going to do now, but I had put I built a commercial section way up here by my airport and put all these giant skyscraper buildings, but they need to be like in the center of the city, which uh, really is going to be down here somewhere. I think my downtown commercial district is going to be like over here. I think eventually I may get rid of all the residential here, move all those people over here, and maybe up here. And just make a huge commercial section. But, uh, but I think I need these giant buildings. You know, maybe I'll do that. Uh, just get them out of the way now. Oh no, it's starting to flicker. Okay, where was this commercial district? This was commercial. <sighs> no. Nope. So far the commercial district is around that. Big uh, roundabout. Okay. Try it again. Columbia Center. Come down here. Commercial district is around this big roundabout. So let us, like maybe, boom, put it right there. Maybe just surround this roundabout with our really huge buildings. Oh, it's all low density. Oh, no. Okay, I'm going to have to... Get rid of all of this. Place it with high density. Okay, did that get rid of all the low density? I believe it did. Okay, high density. Now I don't want anything too close to the roundabout. Don't want anything on the roundabout. But I do want to fill all this with high density. There we go. come over here get rid of all that replace it with 
that. I don't really know if I want. We'll see how the traffic goes there, and then we may. May uh, look at that later. If the traffic, uh, if the traffic gets tied up, we will. <sighs> yeah, see, it's just disappears. What is that? Everything disappears. Is it a glitch in the game? Is it some incompatible mod? I don't know. But uh, I am going to come back up here and grab a few more of these. Nelson Tower. Let's move it. Move it down to... Where are we? Ah, here we are. Come back up here. John Hancock building. One of my favorite buildings. I guess because it's one of the few big skyscraper buildings you can have in this game that I've actually been to. Let's see. We'll put him... There. We'll come back up here. The Mercantile Building. Yeah, see, that should be in your main downtown area. Mega Shopping Center. Oh. Trump World Tower. I'm sure the social justice warriors would be outraged that I even have such a building. I'm sure they will be calling for me to get fired and the mob would... Oh, good. Is it just me or it has... Has anybody else noticed that people are just going insane? This uh, this concept that a person having an opinion that's different of mine, different from mine, is now considered to be violence. And we have people thinking, yeah, you can attack somebody if their opinion is different. Uh, hopefully, these people will all get their butts kicked and. Uh, it's mostly young people who just need to get out and get a job. Okay, I'm going to let that run a little bit and then come and reboot it so I can do th things without all this flickering. But that gets all my... Uh... Oh, new city hall. It's, uh, it's not a huge building, but the city hall needs to kind of be downtown doesn't have to be like right in the middle of the our little square here but that would be a good place for it there we go I will save this that did save as my Istanbul 2020 okay save um, okay I am going to let that run a little bit uh, my uh, it's going to take a while for my commercial areas to rebuild, but uh, ah, how are they doing on parks? I've kind of got little parks everywhere. How are they doing on subway stations? No subways. Oh wait, one subway.
tell you what I'm going to do. I am going to uh, let's use the net picker. Grab this road here. Take a straight line and let's just run these up here. Make them high density commercial. And I want to, I have downloaded some new metro stations, uh, subway for those of you in the United States. Uh, And these are like multi stations with multi platforms. Uh, do I don't I have one that will go on a you know like see here's two different subways. Two different subways. But I thought I had one that would that you could put it on a small road. And it would give you one on each corner. See, that's for a big road. That's for a big road. Big road. Big road. Doesn't have one on each corner. Big road. And that does not have one on each corner. I could have swore I had, like, one on each corner for a small road. I'll have to uh, look around to... Uh, see about that but uh, let us then take this one and we will plop that sucker right here let us pause and we will have to Uh, tell you what I'm going to do. First, I'm going to take my track and nah, let's because see, I don't know what's going to happen to my routes. Looks like I have one, two, three, four, five different routes. Okay, I'm just going to bulldoze this. Grab my track. Now, what will happen when I unpause the game? Will the routes Okay, that one, that one moved. Drag line to add stop. I think I, I added a stop. Okay, will the others move? Come on, come on. Come on. Drag line to add stop. Add stop. Okay, I am adding stops. I am adding stops. Now I just have the pink one. Okay. Is that... There it is. Where's the pink? 
come on. Did that add a stop? I think I added a stop. I think I actually... I think they all have stops here. Very good. Of course, I probably can't see any people. Anyways, I am going to let that run for a little bit. And I shall return. Stay tuned. And I am back. I've actually uh, done a few things here. In addition to letting uh, the game run for a while. I decided I would put a commuter train station over here on my little island community. Uh, this isn't really where I wanted to put it. I was like wanting to put it up here somewhere, but slope too steep. It wouldn't let me put it there. So I had to put it here. Only four passengers. <sighs> Better pick up on that. I saw a whole bunch of people. Anyways, I ran the line across here. Put a station right here so people can like, if they're just going right there. Now that served 81 passengers. I also put a subway right here with a little uh, pedestrian walkway connecting the two so people can come across from the island jump on the subway. I didn't know I didn't want to see if I could run a subway tunnel under this little channel. But anyways, I put a little walkway, subway station, 55 people. Okay, if this served 55 and this served 81, where are where are these people going? Let's see where this train are the trains not well, that train didn't even bother going across. And I also had the track run all the way around the island this way. And then take off and go across the channel. and connect up with my uh, train track here. This is the one that originally had nothing and was going out of town that way, which I have connected, brought around here, and it's connected into there. Like they can, it's kind of a long way around, but uh, these people can go wherever they need to go. And I probably should... What I probably should do is take this line, connect it, run it around, connect it down here to this passenger station, and then I could put a passenger station or two up here for the uh, people who want to uh, go to work in these areas. Uh, though I could connect it, connect this around to here. Yeah, that's definitely a possibility. And then run a spur down into where, okay, I guess I don't have a 
commuter train station in the downtown area. Oh wait, I have... Where'd it go? I thought I had something. Ah, yes, yes I do. No, that's cargo. Um... Yeah, here. Train station. Only 20 people served last week. So I do have a train station there. I could connect this up to there, loop that around there. Yeah, I could possibly do something like that. Anyways, I have 216,000 people, which I thought I had a lot more. Um... Yeah, I was up to like 250 or so, two, yeah, 247,000. This, I don't get this, this oscillation. Oh, influx is oscillating, but it's not an extreme. Wow, death rate. I'm getting these weird fluctuations in death rates. What? City value. My city value went from like nothing and all of a sudden just jumped up to 89 gazillion dollars. <laughs> I don't quite get that. That's weird. Anyways, let's save the game here. Um, let's, let's see, my last video was 45, almost 47 minutes. Um, let's see what else to do. I added a few more houses here, uh, over here, put in some houses there. Uh, what else did I do? Uh, well, let's see, wait, we were, we were looking to see. Okay, it's going to be a while before this, uh, commercial zone gets ramped up. That may take it a while. Now, over here, I was just wondering. Okay, yeah, these left some blank holes where my special purpose buildings were. Hmm. I also have some holes there. Okay. Uh, this little area is filling up quite nicely. And how is my traffic? 71% still not doing too bad. Uh, train traffic seems to be absolutely horrible. Uh, I don't know what I can do about that because it does not seem to be... It all seems to be out of town. Nothing can get out of town. Because it's just kind of stuck there. But uh, I think I will wrap this up. And this was episode 13. I will see you on episode 14.